Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you are tied into the Google ecosystem and find yourself using one or two of the apps and services on a, re on a regular basis like I do, then this is just a quick video to let you know about some changes in case you're unaware that have rolled out to one or two of the apps and services recently. And then also some upcoming changes we can expect to see in the near future. Now, in no particular order, the first one is regarding Google Tasks. So if you use Google Tasks and you have the site panel open now uh, in your browser, if you head to the three dotted menu, you'll see now there is a print list option. So you can now print out a list of your tasks. And if you click on that, you are now able to print that task list, list out, which I think could be handy for some users um, of Google Tasks. And then the next is regarding the new visual redesign, which I did post on um, a couple of months ago that rolled out for Gmail. And um, this was a whole visual redesign. And I'll leave that uh, link to that video down below um, uh, if you're interested. But this is just a quick heads up to let you know that as of today, the 29th of June, 2022, um, previously this was a option that wasn't enabled by default. Now starting today, um, the new user interface you are um, will be enabled now by default for most users. But if you still like the old classic look, you can still just head to the gear icon and you can go back to the original Gmail view. And um, that'll just take you back to that. And that'll just take a second to load. And at any time, if you want to revert to the, um, the new visual redesign, which is just a, a more fluent kind of um, looking more modern look to the Gmail as mentioned in that previous video, you can just head back again to your gear icon and then you can reload that new look. So previously it um, wasn't enabled by default. You had the option to opt in. Now, as I mentioned today, the 29th of June, um, this for most users now is going to be enabled by default. And then you can just go back to classic view by heading to the settings. And then the next uh, change is regarding Google contacts, which is a small minor change. Um, and I don't know if you might have noticed it, but if you just head to a contact and I've just created a test contact here, for the purposes of this video. Um, the contacts now have a card style visual redesign. So for your contact details, you'll notice there's a fluent kind of uh, um, card style redesign um, that's been placed around your details. And for any other details you have, these will be separated and it'll be now um, rolled out with that new card style visual redesign, which I actually think is a nice improvement, which just separates different details regarding your contacts. And then just a quick mention, and um, this we can expect to see rollouts um, later on uh, uh, this year. Um, Google Hangouts apparently will shut down in November of this year, 2022, and it's going to be replaced by Google Chat. And uh, um, what's happening here, according to Google, is that um, if you are still using Hangouts, um, on a mobile device, you will receive an in-app message telling you to switch to the chat app or chat in Gmail. And then a similar request will be made to users of the Hangouts Chrome extension to switch to chat on the web or download the chat web app. And then starting in July, as mentioned, um, that's rolling out soon. Those still using Hangouts in Gmail on the web will be automatically upgraded to chat in Gmail because you have the option. Uh, if you go to your Gmail settings, if you just go to see all settings, you have the option. Yeah, if we go to chat and meet, you have the option to have um, classic Hangouts or Google Chat. And as mentioned, starting in July, um, if you are still using Hangouts um, in Gmail on the web, that will automatically now upgrade you to Google Chat. So that's just a couple of um, features I just wanted to highlight in case you were unaware and hadn't noticed that have been made available now for mainly tasks, Gmail and contacts. And then that um, Hangouts is, is going over to um, and will be automatically upgraded to chat uh, in Gmail in July of this year. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.